Police in College Place, Washington, believe they've stopped what could have been another school massacre. Under arrest is a 17-year-old boy turned in by his mom. Tonight, she's speaking out to our Jamie Yukis. I know a lot of people that go to College Place High School. Their lives would have been forever changed. It's devastating. She wanted us only to use her first name, Nicole. I know I did all I can do and that I made the right choice. That choice was calling police after finding and reading her son's journal. He wrote about attacking his school on a specific date, April 20th, 2020. The anniversary of Columbine, which is freaky and kind of scary, very scary. The journal went into chilling detail. He would detonate pipe bombs and use multiple firearms to blast anyone in sight and execute survivors. How does that make you feel as a mom? Like I've done something wrong. Police believe she did everything right. She's very courageous. It's clearly very emotional for her. She loves her son. And you really wrestled with making the call to the police. Yeah, my son told them that he was into creative writing and that it was just a story. Well, he's plotting to attack and kill people. That's, uh, that's beyond creative writing. That's beyond normal. This angelic looking toddler is now 17. His mom says he'd been battling depression. I'm worried about his mental health and he needs help. So you think he's safer right now in jail? Yeah, I do. And you're safer right now with him in jail. Yes, I am. That's a hard thing to admit. Yeah, truth hurts sometimes. <laughs> you still love your son? Of course I do. It takes a lot to do what I did. It wasn't easy. She's parenting. That's what we need parents to do. Do you feel she saved people's lives? Absolutely. Uh, very courageous, very grateful. So are all the students, teachers, and staff, saved by possibly the toughest choice a mother can make. Jamie Ucas, CBS News, College Place, Washington.